Real deal, mi gente. What's up, my people? This is George Hugh Garcia, the vegan disc golfer, coming at you with another amazing product review of the Disc Dot. Uh, the Disc Dot is an amazing product that I've been supporting and using for months now, and they're absolutely fantastic uh, to implement in your putting routines. I'm going to explain how I use them in my putting routine because I feel that it's very general for anybody and it's very effective. Um, I've created what I call hit zones, um, and in these hit zones are like the sweet spot. Um, I'll use a baseball reference. When you're playing baseball and you hit that sweet spot on the bat, you're getting great consistency the ball, of ball flights and such. So if you hit these zones on the basket, you're going to have great consistencies in your putt, and it's going to shave strokes off your game tremendously. And we all know putting in this game is as important as anything in any other game. So these hit zones, not only are they visible from a great distance, a lot of people tell you to aim for a link. I don't agree with that because that's going to be hard from 90 feet. You got to pick a zone, right? So I created zones uh, to aim at. I know that these zones on any basket are going to catch. Uh, that's the sweet spot of the basket. Um, and for my putts, I know that I go if I go to the right, to the left, above, or even below, I'll probably either hit the cage or I'm not going to make the putt. So if I aim for these hit zones, wherever I am, 10, 20, 30 feet, 40 feet further, I know that chances are my putt's gonna catch. I have a spin putt, um, and no matter what type of putt you have, this is a sweet part of the basket, so chances are it's gonna catch. So I created these zones. I have six disc dots, of course, yellow, that's my favorite color. Um, I use, I try to get yellow discs as much as I can. Orange is my substitute. But yellow has fantastic visibility, even at low light in the evening, for, for example. But they are UV reactive, so if you have a black light, Light them up, keep your practice routine, you know, no matter what time of the day. Um, I have lights out here in my yard that I actually light up so I can practice at night if I feel I need to get a little more. I try to putt at least 100 to 200 putts a day, um, mandatory because I know that's a very important part of the game. And like I said, with these zones implemented, I know that my misses are going to be less and I'm going to hit more birdies on the course. And like I said, once you kind of get that muscle memory and in your brain, you kind of see those zones on the baskets, no matter what type of basket, you're going to increase your ability to make putts from any distance. Down in the comments below, I'm going to put my link to the disc dot with my code so you can get your 10% off. Uh, we have the disc dots available now. Uh, more colors are coming this next week. Uh, there are bag pulls, stickers, lots of other products that are coming down the pipeline. Some big retailers are picking up, so don't miss out the opportunity to get yours. I'm going to demonstrate some putts here on how I use the disc dots, and uh, here we go. All right, so I have my markers set up here on the ground. Oh, this dot's going to have markers as well coming out soon as well. Um, these markers on the ground here are my distance markers. I have 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, and 35. I'm also participating in the NADGT uh, putting finals here next month, which is exciting for me. Uh, I'm representing Florida, so that, 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 that's, uh, that's pretty cool. And um, these are the actual distances that we'll be using in the competition in four putters, so as you can see in my hand. Um, I'm using the P Model S putters uh, by Prodigy. They're absolutely fantastic. I love the way they fly, lots of glide. Uh, shameless plug. <laughs> but they're great putters. Um, so I'm going to be putting for 15, 20, and 25, so you can kind of get an idea of how I use them in my putting routine. 15. See, I missed a little low on that one, but I know that chances are my spin putting, if I hit a little low on the right side, it's going to catch. Same thing applies to the left side. Back to 20. And you can see I'm right on those hit zones, so I know that the top puck's gonna stick. And like I said, from the camera, it's about 35 feet away from the basket and clearly visible um, on the basket your hit zones. Um, there's lots of colors, so uh, you get to pick your, your poison or what you like. I like yellow discs and orange, as you can see. Um, that's what I primarily choose for my disc colors, and it makes sense that I would choose that for my disc dots as well. Uh, move back to 25. 
See, there's a miss. I missed my zone. There it is. There it is. A little low on that one. Let's try that again. Skip out the basket, but demonstration purposes, right? Not gonna make every single one. But anyways, like I said, that's how I use them in my putting routine, and I can see those from any distance. Um, you know, and it gives me great visibility. It gives me a zone to aim at. And like I said, that's where I aim my putt at. So that I know on any basket, um, no matter what the make is, um, those putts are typically gonna stick. Now you have other conditions, wind and other things that play a factor in that, but in all reality, if you hit the heart of the chains or you hit enough chains, usually they'll do a good job of catching them. So guys, um, I'm really excited about this product and the many other things that this dot has coming uh, your way, my way, everybody's way. Um, so be sure to pick you up some, like I said, down in the comments. There's gonna be the link to my um, code for 10% off. Be sure to go get yours. They're selling out quick. There's some big retailers that are picking up on this guy. So you know what? This is the next best tool that you're gonna get to help your game. We all know that putting is one of the most important aspects of the game that we all love and we all enjoy. So until the next one, guys, keep hitting your lines.